Good morning. Welcome to Campbell University and the class of 2020 graduation celebration. Now, as you are able, please stand and remain standing for the entry of the university mace. Please be seated. Well, good morning and welcome to our 2020 commencement service on May the 9th, 2021. It looks as though you were uh, transported from about a year ago in a time machine to here. And I think there were many times this last year we wish that we could have been in a time machine to go either back to the past or forward to the future but we appreciate your patience and um, the uh, token of hope that your presence here is today. And we are delighted to have you with your friends and your family joining us for this in-person ceremony. We've said many times that COVID-19 has disrupted our lives in so many ways. <clears throat> you know that from your inability to have a graduation ceremony in person last year. And we faced enormous challenges during the last 12 to 14 months. But we made it to the end of this academic year here at Campbell maintaining in-person classes. Our university motto is ad astra prospera, which means to the stars through difficulty. And we have been living through one of the most difficult periods in recent history, but this experience will only make us stronger. We have all adapted and we will persevere. And as we wrap up this academic year, there are many reasons to believe that the worst is behind us and there is hope for a return to some sense of normalcy in the coming months. The graduates from all Campbell University colleges and schools will participate in this morning's ceremony. And at this time, I would like to recognize each dean of the school and when I call his or her name, I would ask that he or she would stand. We go in alphabetical order, almost, Dr. Michael Adams, Dean of the College of Pharmacy and Health Sciences. Dr. Alfred Bryant, Jr., Dean of the School of Education. Dr. Jenna Carpenter, Dean of the School of Engineering. Dr. Kevin O'Mara, Dean of the Landy Fetterman School of Business. 
Dr. Beth Rubin, Dean of Adult and Online Education. Dr. Andrew Wakefield, Dean of the Divinity School. Dr. Michael Wells, Dean of the College of Arts and Sciences. Dean Rich Leonard of the Campbell Law School. And our newest Dean, who has been nine days on the job, Dr. Brian Kessler, Dean of the Campbell University School of Medicine. Please join me in thanking my colleagues for their commitment and excellent work at our university. <laughs> and the next portions of our program are as follows. The morning's invocation will be given by Dr. Jenna Carpenter, Dean of the School of Engineering. Greetings will be extended by Mr. Ben Thompson, Chairman of the Campbell University Board of Trustees and an alumnus of Campbell University, class of 1976, and a graduate of the first law school class in 1979. Following greetings by Chairman Thompson, scripture will be read by Dr. Kevin O'Mara, Dean of the Lundy Fetterman School of Business, and he will read from Psalm 100. Dr. Carpenter, would you please come and bring her invocation. Please join me in prayer. Our Heavenly Father, given the enormous challenges and loss that we have all experienced this past year, it is difficult to find the words to express both how grateful and how elated we all are for the opportunity to finally be here today in person to celebrate the accomplishments of these Campbell University graduates. We thank you for your provision and guidance during these challenging times. We are so grateful for the planning and effort, adaptability and determination that these students, our faculty, staff, administrators shown in this past year along with support of family and friends to help ensure that these graduates were able to safely finish their education and be here today to celebrate. As we reflect on the last 15 months, we cannot help but be reminded of the Campbell University motto, ad astra per aspera, to the stars through difficulty. For while this has indeed been perhaps the most stressful year in most of our memories, we are so grateful that you have helped us persist through these challenges, O oh Lord, to make today one of the most joyous occasions in our collective memory. We close by asking your blessing on each of these graduates in what is still an uncertain world. We ask for your wisdom and protection as they continue to launch their careers and lives we are so thankful that you sent these students our way and for the privilege we had to teach, serve, and work alongside them. We are truly proud to call them Campbell Camels. In Jesus' most holy and precious name, amen. Good morning. Graduates, distinguished guests, family members, and friends, on behalf of the Campbell University Board of Trustees, I would like to welcome you to this 2020 graduation ceremony. This is indeed a wonderful day that we can be together and celebrate the achievement of our graduates. To the members of the graduating class of 2020, we celebrate this day with you and recognize that your graduation is the culmination of years of hard work. Dr. Creed, I have always wanted to run out on the football field under the goalpost for a big ball game. This is not exactly the same situation, but I do feel that much excitement. The fact that we're having this graduation ceremony today makes me want to suit up and play. For you 2020 graduates, this is indeed a day of celebration. But as we celebrate, we cannot help but to remember all that you graduates and your families had to overcome during this journey. Perhaps the understatement of the day is COVID-19 has had an impact on nearly every aspect 
of our lives for the last 14 months. Most certainly, the, this pandemic has affected your educational experiences in ways that we cannot begin to understand or appreciate. The class of 2020 probably was affected more than any other class. You had to complete your work in a time of fear and uncertainty. Somehow, you got it done. Yesterday, I was listening to the news and I heard a commentator say, it is so sad that we lost an entire year of education because of this pandemic. Now that might have been the case elsewhere, but that certainly was not the case here at Campbell. Here at Campbell, we dealt with the obstacles and somehow made it. Be assured that the Board of Trustees appreciates deeply your flexibility and your resilience as we charted these unknown courses together. While it was not like we had hoped for or planned last year, thank you for your patience and persistence leading up to this grand occasion, your 2020 graduation. Graduates, while this is indeed a day for you to celebrate, never forget those family members and loved ones who not only helped make your education possible, but also have provided love and support during your college journey and especially during these difficult times. I know that parents, spouses, other family members and loved ones, as you completed your work last year, you did so with a sense of pride and for most folks, a sense of relief. Perhaps many of you will reflect back and say, I don't know how we did it. So graduates, you have indeed been at Campbell during some very challenging times. As I said at the beginning, the mere fact that we are having an in-person graduation today is an accomplishment to overcome challenges. I remember so clearly our virtual graduation ceremony last year when there were five of us on the stage and we were speaking to an empty audience. While it was disappointing not to have an in-person graduation last year, that's not something we should really be sad about. We should celebrate because of you, the graduates. For you, the members of the class of 2020, you have already gone out and started to make your mark in this world. Graduates, we are confident that you are prepared for your life's work, and the experiences you have had at Campbell will continue to be a positive influence on you for the rest of your lives. You now join the ranks of thousands of others who have graduated from Campbell and gone out into the world to make their mark. Again, never forget where you came from. Campbell has served you well, and it's time now for you to join the circle of alumni and serve Campbell as well. We are confident that you will always make us Campbell proud. Again, we congratulate you on this wonderful achievement and wish you Godspeed. Thank you. Good morning. Psalm 100. Make a joyful noise unto the Lord, all ye lands. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence with singing. Know ye that the Lord, he is God. It is he who has made us, and not we ourselves. We are his people, and the sheep of his pasture. Enter into his gates with thanksgiving and unto his courts with praise. Be thankful unto him and bless his name. For the Lord is good, his mercy is everlasting, and his truth endureth for all generations. Thank you. I am honored to present Ms. Marsha McCoy as our commencement speaker this morning. Ms. McCoy is a Campbell University alumnus of the class of 2008, earned a master's degree from Florida State University as an instructor in speech communications and public speaking at Wake Tech Community College. She also currently serves as the president of the Campbell University Alumni Board. I'm so glad she's here this morning because in so many ways she embodies what is the very best about Campbell University. 
her spirit, her commitment, and her loyalty. And as you will see in a moment, she is a gifted speaker. I would tell you this morning to hold on to your hat because the wind is blowing a little bit, but when she speaks, you'll know what else I mean by that admonition. At this time, I would like to welcome Ms. McCoy to the podium as our commencement speaker. Thank you so much. Platform party, family and friends, graduates of 2020. This graduation belongs to you. This graduation belongs to you. You deserve it. 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 All of the pictures belong to you. All of the memories belong to you. This walk across the stage belongs to you. 2020, this graduation belongs to you. You deserve it. You deserve it. You deserve it. This graduation belongs to you. 2020, special edition. You are that class. You are the class that made things happen. You are the class that literally exemplifies our motto at Astra Per Aspera. You've heard it and you'll keep hearing it. You are the class that went to the stars through difficulties. So on this graduation day and experience, I need you to work with me. So hold up your right hand with the letter C. Thank you, thank you. And take your left index finger and just loop it in the air. Mm -hmm. Just loop, no, loop in the air. Loop out in the air. Because I charge you to do two things. Celebrate and keep going. Do it again. Celebrate and keep going. The celebration is so very important. According to Merriam-Webster, it is a verb which means to honor someone in a solemn occasion, exhibit A. But also it means to make a change from your normal routine. This graduation is so important because you were used to doing school. You were used to taking classes, but it's time to stop and celebrate. Celebration involves going down memory lane. It's Sunday morning. You can throw your hands up if you can testify. How many of you all remember Freshman Moving Day? Uh-huh, uh-huh. You remember pulling your clothes and all your suitcases across the yard, breaking a sweat, going up and down stairs, looking for a parking space? You did that. Do you remember your first day, your first set of classes? I remember it well. Dr. Martin, Western Civilization, 10 o'clock. It was a Wednesday, and I almost passed out with the syllabus alone. I had to go straight to Marshbanks and get a meal. I went back down memory lane, and I thought about all those years, all of those tests, all of those sleepless nights with Dr. Pepper to write those papers. I thought about all of that, and I came to this occasion and realized celebrations are important. We have to take the time to stop and celebrate. Otherwise, we'll feel like we don't have anything accomplished. So when you take the time to celebrate, take your pictures, take them with family and friends. All of 
of it matters. You didn't walk across the stage when you finished freshman year or sophomore year or junior year. This celebration is important and we wanted to make sure that you had to have the full experience because you earned it. So when you walk, walk it out, but walk safely. And once you celebrate it along with other people, make sure you keep going. Today is another special day, and I'm glad to be the first one to openly acknowledge it, but it is Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day. Give it up for the mamas. Hey, mama. Mothers are so important, but mothers are actually one of the best examples of individuals who kept going. Because of a mother, you literally are here in this physical seat. A mother found out that you were beginning to develop inside, so she decided, I have to keep going. Because nine months down the road, I'm going to have a big test, the biggest exam called labor. There were different colors of the rainbow involved. Vocabulary probably changed. She probably unleashed the dragon. But at the end of the experience, when you made your grand entrance, she switched from keep going to celebrate because you are here. So when we think about keep going, you finished that first semester. You saw your report card, and yet you still kept going. You saw good grades. You said, help me, Jesus. You kept going. And then March of 2020 happened, and you were thrown into an online environment without your permission, but you kept going. So I am here to tell you today to continue that because we have to help other people keep going. So when you keep going, because you are alumni, that's why I'm so excited about this opportunity, you need to reach back and help somebody else keep going. We have a legacy here at Campbell University, and we keep going. Join Camelink, mentor.campbell.edu, alumni.campbell.edu, Yes, we keep going because on this day, we look at you and how you kept going. That's why we celebrate. I leave you with these words, a true prayer out of Numbers chapter 6, verses 24 through 26. My darling, dear alum, the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord lift up his countenance of favor upon you and give you peace. Graduates of 2020, celebrate and keep going. What did I tell you? <laughs> well, she could speak, she can sing. I bet she could dance if we asked her to get up here and do that, but not this morning. I, I feel like I've been to church today, and I, I, I want to make a change in the program and take up an offering, but uh, that's not why you came here. In fact, we have now come to that long-awaited time for the awarding of the degrees for the class of 2020. And some of you have been waiting for six months for this moment, and some of you have been waiting for an entire year. So I now invite Provost Hammond to the podium for the presentation of the graduates. Thank you, Dr. Greed. Good morning. Some information to share. First, 2020 graduates participating today are those listed in the program with your respective degrees earned. Second, the tradition of Campbell University is for the family and friends of each graduate to stand as he or she crosses the stage. 
Third, to honor the significance of the occasion and out of respect for both graduates and guests, we're requesting appropriate behavior throughout the ceremony. Please be polite to fellow guests in the stands. However, given our wonderful venue of this outdoor stadium, uh, family members as you stand, please do applaud and celebrate your graduates today. Finally, the names of the graduates will be called by Ms. Georgia Martin, Associate Professor of Theater Arts in the College of Arts and Sciences. As graduates cross the stage, they will receive their diplomas from President Creed. They will also be extending congratulations or hooded by their academic deans. And now, will all graduates please stand? At this time, President J. Bradley Creed will affirm your degrees as presented in the graduation program. You will then present yourself by the appropriate degrees as you are recognized. Dr. Creed, upon the recommendation of the deans and faculties of the university and Vice President for Academic Affairs and Provost of the University, we hereby present the graduates who have earned the degrees as presented in the graduation program. Thank you, Dr. Hammond. And upon the presentation by the Vice President for Academic Affairs and Provost and the deans and faculties of the schools of Campbell University, I am pleased to affirm your degrees earned with all rights, privileges, and responsibilities pertaining thereto. Congratulations, graduates, and please be seated. And now will the recipients of the degrees, Associate in Arts, Associate of Science, Bachelor of Applied Science, and Bachelor of Health Science, please stand and come forward to receive your diploma. Hunter Griffiths. <laughs> Lennon O. Arias. Frederick Devon Bowie, magna cum laude. Jonathan Alvin Burrell, Sr. Jonathan R. Collins, magna cum laude. Laura Lorente Saez, magnum cum laude. Russell Wesley, Jr. Melissa K. Payne. Eric S. Parham, summa cum laude. Francisco Xavier Prioto. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give a round of applause for these graduates. Thank you. 
And now, will the recipients of the degree Bachelor of Business Administration please stand and come forward to receive your diploma. Jumana Aki. <laughs> Alexandra Jean Caudle. <laughs> Colin Jack Cooper, magnum cum laude. John M. Craig III. Luvia Samantha de Arcia. Parker Diatli. Telfenia Artlet Dunn. Hunter Fushi. Darlis Ariana Gibson. Cecilia Adrian Gillum Parrish. Andrea Gunther Magnum Cum Laude. Ashton Brooke Hayes. Summa cum laude. Jeffrey Morgan Johns. Alexa Michelle Calliston, magnum cum laude. Courtney Nicole Manis, cum laude. Sarah K. Mason. Trevor Edward Milligan, cum laude. Diego Ochoa Ramos. Alex Melvin Tyler Reed. Roberta Michelle Rodriguez. Samantha Ann Sawyer. Woo! 
Bishop Smith. Henry Victor Stotts. Mary Elizabeth A. Wallace. Haley Annette Williamson. Matthew Leon Wilson. Tatiana Espiritu Wilmore, cum laude. Zachary D. Weinbarger. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give a hearty round of applause for these graduates. <clears throat> and now will the recipients of the degrees, Bachelor of Science, Bachelor of Social Work, Bachelor of Arts, and Bachelor of Music, please stand and come forward to receive your diploma. Ayman Abu Hamad. Sarah Grace Alby. Michaela Fortin Alexian Cum Laude. Alan Blackman. <laughs> Hannah Lee Brohau. <laughs> Angelica Ruth Brown, magnum cum laude. Jeremiah Bowie. <laughs> Hannah Faye Bird, summa cum laude. Sarah Elise Bird. Haley Elizabeth Campbell, cum laude. Lindsay D. Chin. Anna B. Christley. Casper Duell, cum laude.
Brianna Simone Donovan. Chelsea Elizabeth Ferguson. Jordan Renee Gagnon. Michaela Carice Gasso. Dorlisa A. Graham, cum laude. Lisa Alexandra Gerganus. Tiara Nael Harley. Courtney Jackson. Sue Ellen Jones, summa cum laude. Megan Taylor King. Anna Kelly Langdon, summa cum laude. James Chester Letsom Jr. Ashley Main, summa cum laude. Justin Ray Maldonado. Casey Marie Martin. Tamia Lachey McDougald. Fiona Rose Milmo. Amber Marguerite Mobley, summa cum laude. Heather Neely Moore. Jyla Michelle Moore. Lane Ray Moore, cum laude. Taylor Danielle Naran, summa cum laude. Madison Elise Newton, cum laude. Chelsea Parker. Jenna Alexandra Parker. Diego Barra Sanchez. John Scott Patterson. Chesney Brianne Paul.
Kristen Mary Powell, summa cum laude. Tanasia Chanel Powell. Savannah Ray Presley, magnum cum laude. Kiara Michaela Rhodes. Michaela Ayana Ryden. Savannah Brooke Robertson. Cassie Marie Robinson. Sharonda Eubanks Rome. Samantha Razier, magnum cum laude. Amber Nicole Ruiz, cum laude. Lizeth Griselda Santiago Morales. Madison Ansley Sauls. Jake Tyler Shoup. Caitlin Victoria Sellers. Andre Septemio. David Lee Sharp, Jr. Alexandra Gabrielle Shaw, magnum cum laude. Faith Elizabeth Steen. Catherine Sutton, summa cum laude. Haley Cree Talton, cum laude. Kaylee Aaron Toms. Kiera E. Torres, cum laude. Andrea Rosemary Turlington. Paige Elizabeth Vincent. Elena Ray Wegner Wallace. Emily West. Cameron James Wilcox.
Mackenzie Blair Williams, cum laude. Brittany Rochelle Wortham. Nicole Francis Wren. Alyssa Ashlyn Lee, summa cum laude. Samantha Dawn Martin, cum laude. Kayla Marie Banks, cum laude. Christian Robert Blanton. Daniel Lee Crandall, magnum cum laude. Myron Antonio Davis, Jr. Quinton Perez. Brad Mark Dennis. Reginald R. Juan Harris. Miles Baker Hunt, Hunt, summa cum laude. Janine Lambeth, magna cum laude. Caroline Elizabeth Leach. Devin Renee McGowan. Glenn Michael McNeil. Samantha Laura Nestor, magnum cum laude. Dennis Pitt. Bryce Thomas Pittman. Erendira Elizabeth Ramirez. Damali Reed. Hannah Nicole Stewart. Paige A. Tonkins. Jonathan W. Trichler. Rachel Carroll West, cum laude. Alyssa Dean Wolf.
Kadeem Win. Olivia Celeste Exum, summa cum laude. James Austin Medlin, magna cum laude. Caitlin Carter Medlin. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give a hearty round of congratulations to these graduates. And now, will the recipients of the degree Bachelor of Science in Nursing please stand to come forward to receive your diploma. Susan Grace Bass. Jillian Abigail Benton. Emily May Korenik. Zuheri Sere Levano Cruz. Megan Catherine Shoemaker. Lauren Deanna Stone, cum laude. Elizabeth Biff Marie Swires. How about a round of applause for our nursing graduates? And now, will the recipients of the Bachelor of Science in Engineering please stand and come forward to receive your diploma.
Charles W. Andrews III. Patrick Holden Bradshaw. Matthew Paul Culture, cum laude. Sean Patrick Curran, cum laude. Diana Marie Dinini, magna cum laude. Jacob Lloyd Freeman. John Aaron Harold, cum laude. Morgan K. Hughes, magna cum laude. Brandon Douglas Johnson. Taylor Faith Oakley. <laughs> Nestor Olguin Vasquez. Jacob Grant Roosh. Colleen Skeet. William Trent Strader. Michael J. Williams, summa cum laude. Ladies and gentlemen, these graduates represent our charter class from our School of Engineering. Congratulations, Dean Carpenter and graduates. Extra special round of applause for this charter class. And now, will the recipients of the Master of Business Administration please stand, come forward to be hooded, and to receive your diploma. Jackson L. Allen. <laughs> Patricia Lee Glover Barnes. Zachary Brewer. Go, 
Dalton Lambert Dowd, summa cum laude. Nicholas John Lacerda. Maria Claire Sikardanos, summa cum laude. How about a nice round of our applause for our graduates? And now, will the recipients of the Master of School Administration please stand and come forward to be hooded and to receive your diploma? Diane Stewart Talton with distinction. Let's have a hearty round of applause again for our graduate. And now, will the recipients of the Master of Arts in Christian Ministry, Master of Divinity, and Doctor of Ministry please stand and come forward to be hooded and to receive your diploma. Carolyn Venice Cash. Patricia L. Sutton. Tyler Joshua Cleaver with distinction with languages. Carrollton, Karen Hamilton Lucas with distinction with languages.
Miriam Phillips Stevens. Carol Diane Sampson. Timothy Carl Williams with distinction with languages. Dr. Earl Christopher Carroll. The Reverend Dr. Allison Collier. The Reverend Dr. Jeffrey Philip Mathis. The Reverend Dr. Nathan Todd Morton. Let's give a warm round of applause to our graduates from Divinity. And now, will the recipients of the Master of Science, Doctor of Pharmacy, and Doctor of Physical Therapy please stand and come forward to be hooded and receive your diploma. Shravya Bandaru. John Carey Bonyo, cum laude. Sesidar Govardhan. Sahiti Reddy Kancharla. Jessica Newman. Aman Parashar Kumlade. Alexander Scott Rains. Nikhil Rangolia, magna cum laude.
Anna Catherine Reynolds, magnum cum laude. Niha Regendra Shihirude, cum laude. Jordan Stuber. <laughs> Sterling Taban. <laughs> Shannon Leanna Ellis Webb. Dr. Jeremy Wayne Barefoot, magnum cum laude. Thank you. Dr. Chelsea Sierra Bennett. Dr. Brittany Love Bowers, magnum cum laude. Dr. Thomas Cameron. Dr. Tristan Lauren Carteract. Dr. Amanda K. Deskins, cum laude. Dr. Cinderella Gomez. Dr. Sonia Habibi Deaver. Dr. Abby Michaela Harris. Magna cum laude. Dr. Deanna Marie Jasmine, cum laude. Dr. Stephanie Andrea Custos, magnum cum laude. Dr. Evan W. Lucas, cum laude. Dr. Jessua, Dr. Jessica Joel McCoy. Dr. Haroon Mestek, cum laude. Dr. Emily Holmes Miller. Dr. Rebecca Francis Panter. Dr. Casey Leigh Parker. Dr. Lena Poindexter. Dr. Megan Bass Reeves. Dr. Jenna Green Redwine. Congratulations. 
Dr. Holly Gwen Scarlett. Dr. Victoria Ann Sheeran, summa cum laude. Lida Siam Kapoor, doctor. Dr. Jasmine Nicole Spooner. <laughs> Dr. Takesha Smith Thomas, magnum cum laude. Dr. Benjamin Josiah Tutoro. Dr. Kayla Dawn Williamson, summa cum laude. Dr. Chanel D. Wilson, magna cum laude. Let's give a warm round of applause to our graduates from the College of Pharmacy and Health Sciences. And now, will the recipients of the Juris Doctor please stand and come forward to be hooded and receive your diploma. Alondra Margarita Ribiesca Esquire. Alexander Shane Fowler Esquire. Jessica Ruth Haney Esquire. Kempton Lark Healy, Esquire, Magna Cum Laude. Alexis Ora Massingill, Esquire. Mariam J. Robinson, Esquire.
Ladies and gentlemen, let's give a round of our applause for our law school graduates. And now, will the recipients of the Master of Science in Biomedical Sciences and Doctor of Osteopathic Medicine please stand, come forward to receive your diploma and to be hooded. Dr. Casey Lynn Junko, cum laude. Will all graduates please stand now? Ladies and gentlemen, we present to you the class of 2020. How about a big round of applause for these graduates? Glad to have you home. Please be seated. Well, congratulations to all of you. I'm so glad that you've made the effort to come back and celebrate this very special day here at Campbell University. And since finishing your studies, you've ended up in many different destinations across North Carolina, this nation, and even throughout the world. I want to personally thank you for choosing Campbell as the place for your education. There are more than 4,400 colleges and universities throughout the United States. You made a decision to come here. Thank you. It is a decision that has changed your life forever, and your decision has changed this institution. A university is more than brick and mortar, curriculum and transcripts, athletic programs and social networks. It depends on people, people past, present, and future to make up Campbell University and to give it its unique identity, its strong sense of community. I even like to say that you graduates are the soul of Campbell University. Campbell is your alma mater, your great nourishing mother. There is no other institution except perhaps your church with which you will have such a special and lasting relationship. You are now forever a part of Campbell University and Campbell University, wherever you go and whatever you do, is a part of you. Please know sincerely that we will miss you. We are proud of you, the class of 2020, and you are always welcome back home. Remember that here in this thriving university village, located next to a creek in the sand hills of North Carolina, there are people who will think of you. They will remember your name, and they will be grateful that you were a member of this academic community. As you continue into the next chapter of your life, let us all remember the central teaching of Jesus. Those who aspire to greatness are those who have learned to serve others. We wish you much success in making a good living. 
but more importantly, we hope that you make a good life, which involves choosing a life of service and making life better for all human beings. And you can do that with the knowledge and skills that you have gained at Campbell University. When you do this, you truly make a difference now and forevermore. And I leave with you a blessing, which is the prophecy of Zechariah as recorded in the Gospel of Luke. May you know the tender mercy of our God by which the rising sun will come to us from heaven to shine on those living in darkness and in the shadow of death, to guide our feet into the path of peace. Graduates, congratulations again. And at this time, I ask Dr. Beth Rubin, Dean of the Adult and Online Education Program, to join me at the podium, and she will bring the prayer of benediction. Dr. Rubin. Thank you, Dr. Creed. Please rise. Let us pray. Loving God. Baruch ata Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, shehechianu, v'kiyamanu, v'higianu, lazman hazeh. Blessed are you, God, sovereign of all, who has kept us alive and sustained us and brought us together to this wonderful day. Be with us as we go from this place, as we rise up, as we lie down, and as we walk along our way. And we say, Amen. 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 Please remain standing as the University Mace and Platform Party exit the stage. Family and friends, please remain standing as our graduates exit the field. Uh, we're at graduates, we're going to begin in the last row. You're going to exit to your left, and the marshals will direct you. And friends in the stands, let's give it up for the class of 2020.